Now for one of the most dramatic changes of direction ever, uh, ever performed on this program, uh, we <laughs> we invite our uh, our next two guests on the show here, uh, uh, namely uh, Carrie Brothers and Laura Jansen, who are in town for a show tonight at the Showbox at the Market. They are supporting Joshua Raiden. Uh, Carrie and Laura, hi, welcome. Hi. Hello, no sex cults involved. I, that yeah, is very right. as, as, far as, you right. know. as far as you know. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Have you, I, I mean, I know that we're engaged in this topic because she is uh, a West Seattleite, as a yeah. student at the University of Washington. Had you heard about Amanda? Knox? I had, but it, you know, I, I, I hadn't associated the name with the story until until we got here. Yeah. 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 And uh, now what do you think? Guilty or innocent? Oh, I'm going to read the book. Yeah, yeah right. I'm going to read before. the book. That's, that's a, a prudent juror uh, yeah. <laughs> before you pass judgment. That's my middle name. Uh, well, welcome to the show. That's uh, that's Laura Jansen. She's got a, a wonderful CD coming out in just a couple of weeks called Bells. Uh, Carrie Brothers' latest release, his uh, second CD is called Under Control. Uh, did I get that right? And uh, uh, Laura, born in, in uh, the Netherlands. Yes. Born in Holland to a family that refused to lay down roots. <laughs> This is true. So it's, she uh, uh, danced from one country to the next to the next. What was your parent? What were they running away from? Oh, I can't talk about that. Really? Oh, okay. No, 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 I can't yeah. talk about that. No. <laughs> uh, did you spend any time in Italy? In um, uh, on vacation, but not Perugia. Not yeah. Perugia. No, um, no. And, so what countries have you lived in? What countries did you grow up? Uh, the Netherlands, Belgium, Switzerland, uh, a little bit of time in Japan and the States. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And now living down in? Hollywood. Hollywood. You both uh, live down in uh, yep. Los Angeles? Yeah. Crazy place. One of Laura's songs is called Wicked World off this new CD, Bells, and it's about the about yeah. the kind of the creepy things that you see happening around you in, yeah, in it's, Hollywood. Yeah, it's, it's such a weird place. It's like a bunch of runaways and chicks with fake boobs and, you know, creepy music producers and just all these sort of hyper real characters that if you put them through the songwriter lens, they look like fairy tale characters to me. So. I, I bet. Yeah. yeah. Well, Creepy music producers. Oh yeah. There's have you uh, have you experienced what what is a creepy totally. music producer? Huh? Are you kidding? Yeah, the what do they do? in the bedroom. And oh, the, is that right? The whole, you know, I'm going to make you like famous someday. Couch -wise, totally. Yeah, that vibe. Oh, yeah. Does anyone fall for that crap? I'm sure. I'm sure I didn't. That's of how course we, that's you did. Yeah, right. yeah, that's actually but. how we met. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> what if you just, that's how Carrie and I met. Yeah. What if you just choose to have a studio in your bedroom? I mean, you uh, could it, freely do that and probably get away with it. I did have a studio in my bedroom. <laughs> See? That's <laughs> how you made your last record. Because didn't have much space. Uh-huh, yeah. yeah. I mean, space is... Uh, uh, <laughs> Prime. Just sit down right here, and here's the microphone. <laughs> here's the microphone. Uh, so I, I'd be curious, like, what's the creepiest thing you've ever encountered in your in your professional life? I mean, I'm a pretty tiny, I am tiny build, you know, uh -huh. I'm a tiny human being, and you know, I've definitely been told to lose weight by people to be have a chance to be more famous or something, just crap like that. I mean, it's I don't that is take insane. It. It's insane. I mean, and so so you know that, but that definitely exists. You know, the fact that the the first conversation about your music is about the way you look or or how you should look or what you should be doing instead of you know tackling the subject. And men music. don't uh, you you don't get that at all. No one's ever said that. <laughs> yeah, huh. <laughs> although you really could lose some weight. I mean, seriously, you would let yourself Thanks, go. Man. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm Totally teasing. You're under so many layers, I can't see. I can't I know, see so the real carry. I've just got out of Canada. I'm still going to shed one layer at a time on the way down the road. I'll have you know Canada's got nothing on this basement. This basement is uh, ten times as cold it as any... So uh, it's like the Letterman studio. Yeah, yeah. We want you to stay awake while we talk about a murder and... Uh, and a, a corrupt Italian system. Yeah. Um, all right. Well, I, it's so cool to have you guys here. Um, I, I know each one of you is going to perform a song. Um, wh who's going first here? You want us to wrestle for it? Yeah. Yes, please do. Yeah. Or like tic-tac-toe or what is it called? You can go first, Carrie. Okay, fine.